Hello, this is Jack from tofluency.com. Welcome to this special English lesson where you're going to learn English in context. And we're going to do that by me showing you around where we're currently staying in Florida for Christmas. And I'm going to give you vocabulary and phrases related to what you see. So let's start with the pool. So here is the pool. This was one of the things that we wanted for this vacation rental. And we're here with my family, which is great because everyone loves a pool. Now you'll notice a few things. Firstly, it has this fence around the outside. And we requested this because we have a young son who is just over three. And it just makes things a lot safer. Now a couple of things as well. This pool is heated, which means that there is a heat pump for it, which makes it warmer. Because even though the weather is great, the sun's just gone behind a cloud, but even though it's warm, it still needs a little bit of heat to make it more comfortable. The other thing is, you can see over here, my son's swimming shorts and some towels. Now, they are hanging out to dry. They are hanging out to dry right now. Walking over here, you can see these reclining chairs or sun lounges. This is a great place, obviously, to sit back, relax, have a sip of wine, something like that, to drink, eat, and just relax in the sun. This is the outside dining table. And this is where I just recorded a live lesson. There will be a link to that in the description below. Problem is, the internet connection isn't the best here, so I might not be able to go live in HD, but we'll see how it goes. My dad loves to barbecue, and luckily there is this barbecue here. Now this is a coal barbecue. A lot of barbecues in the US are gas powered, so they are gas barbecues, but this one uses coal. If we open it up, you can see it's nice and clean and it's ready to be used. Let's now go for a walk this way. I'm just going to show you the outside of the house. So I'm going to open up the gate. This is a good gate to have because, again, my son can't reach this. This keeps everything, everything secure. Now we're going to go down the side of the house and note, notice that we have lots of flowers. If you look next door, they have flowers on their plants and their bushes as well. And that's because in Florida, it doesn't really get cold here. It's the middle of December and it's really warm right now. Speaking of warm, this is the heater for the pool. And apparently it gets really expensive if you run it all the time. And that's a great verb to use, to run the water heater or to run the pool heater. This is the front of the house and the road that goes down here. Luckily, we found a house that is at the end of a cul-de-sac. It's the, at the end of a dead-end road, which means that there's not a lot of traffic. There's not a lot of through traffic. It's so quiet out here. It's really peaceful and relaxing. One thing you might have noticed, palm trees. So in Florida, there are palm trees everywhere. And over here in the bins, I'll just take you over there. Over here you can see some dead plants or dead trimmings of plants. And what happens is they leave these out here and people will come and pick them up, take them to a yard and turn them into mulch. And mulch is something that you can put under trees to help keep the soil nice and moist. One thing I do want to show you is next door because they have incredible Christmas decorations. And last night, I'll show you a picture on Facebook, but these lights are incredible. They have lights all down the side of the house, in this bush here, on everything that you see out here. It's an incredible sight. Now I'm just sitting on the front on a rocking chair. This is, again, it's just so peaceful out here. You can probably hear some traffic in the background, but when the birds are singing, 
in the morning, you can't hear anything. And it's just a great place to be. Now, we chose Florida for our Christmas vacation because my family and I wanted to meet up. We wanted to spend Christmas together, but we wanted to go somewhere warm. And because we have just had a baby, my parents and my sister decided to come and see us so that we didn't have to get on a plane and travel long distances. So they flew to Florida and we're just gonna spend Christmas together. If you take a look at the description, I'll leave some words and phrases that I use in this video below. And that means that you'll be able to learn some English in context. Let me know if you have any questions about what we've talked about in this video. If you're new here, please subscribe. Thank you for watching. See you in the next lesson.